Madden 25 is here, and today we're gonna break down every rookie and player likeness update in Madden NFL 25. First round rookies, that is. And oh yeah, I wanted to say thank you for all the support on the previous Madden videos, the early content. Shout out EA and shout out to you guys. And hit that like button if you want more updates and Madden 25 content. And uh, let's get to 60K, 60,000 subscribers as soon as possible. So today we're gonna look at the first round of rookies in Madden NFL 25. And this is the full build, the early release build versus the other build. Now I had a different build I was on courtesy of EA Sports and the Creator Network and they didn't have everything, but I've scrubbed through the rosters up and down and I found new rookies, new face scans and stuff that was not in the previous build. So if y'all ready, get your popcorn ready. Let's break down these face scans. Let's get into it, man. So let's kick this video off with Caleb Williams from USC, the first round draft pick. And does he have a face scan? Caleb has the face scan, fam. Let's go in and look at his appearance. And now we get to really break it down because I have all the time I need to break these down for you guys. Subscribe to the channel if you like stuff like this. Hit that like button, we're about to turn up. How, you have to put my arms up on the Brady, you know what I'm talking about? Anyway, Caleb Williams right here, as you can see, the final version of him looks dope. If you look at the close up, you see everything on Caleb Williams. Attention to detail is there. Like I said, the princess cut earrings, you know what they were trying to get at with the mirror shine ea doing a thing but if i pull back you see the whole full body right here so as far as kayla williams he's here he's in the game we got kayla williams in the game if you want to look at him in apparel i've scrubbed this up and down so many times with the early access version of madden that i know how to get look at everything and how to get there fast so yeah this is what i specialize in so subscribe to the channel guys if y'all want to see more of this and i love equipment i love breakdowns but here's kayla williams here's the full body the full look of kayla williams at his best in madden nfl 25 we're good to go kayla williams was here if i go to torso it's going to remove the helmet where you can get a longer view of him and you can see what he looks like and i mean this is it ladies and gentlemen the first round draft pick in mad nfl kayla williams we have the second round draft pick from the nfl draft for the washington commanders from lsu Jaden daniels right here let's go ahead and look at him right here so you can see i'll just go over to the appearance tab and get a close-up everything is always more crispier in the final version of madden and if you have had an early version of madden where it was in studio build you would know that check him out right here man looks great it's hair is on point i'm not gonna lie if you look at the technology it was a huge jump from madden 24 to madden 25 it was a huge leap as far as in technology of face scans and the rig that ea sports is using right now this is it this looks great i want to pull back on the physique so you can look at the whole body this is him with all his equipment on he drippy he's dripped out drip meter out there uh probably like a 7.5 out of a 10 but yeah here we go Jaden daniels lsu now if i go over to apparel let's look at him in his helmet there you go right here close up pull back the full body it's looking good man and it crosses over great Great in gameplay as well in game so when you're playing the game it looks pretty good let's click torso so we can get that long view here we go right here he even has the bump on his head as you can see right there on his forehead over his if we're looking at it, his left eye this is pretty explanatory for what it is go up close and you do see that little bump on his face and i guess the scan really picked that up as well so there we go man number two draft pick Jaden daniels qb from lsu let's get to number three we have the third pick in the nfl draft by the name of drake may for the new england Patriots, you can see my jersey says and yes i am a pats fan drake may let's go ahead and take a look at him and edit a player suite go to appearance and it looks just like drake may now one thing i did see with drake may with the preseason game is how small he i don't i, th I thought it was kind of small for his size that's just the television cameras giving us a view of drake may but this face looks just like drake may it's on point for the number three pick in the NFL draft, Drake May looks just like him. I, but I, I do honestly feel like Drake May is okay. Look, okay, look at this. Look at his uh the back of his shoulder pads are kind of kind of big. Maybe that's something that's gonna get patched up, and maybe that's some EA already caught. But we haven't got the full version of Madden out yet. But Drake May right here, and if we do go over to apparel, we will see Drake May in his NFL apparel, and he looks dope from head to toe. The towel is there now. In the previous bill, Drake May had like a hole, some type of like clipping with that. NFL towel on his front part of his leg, but it's not clipping anymore. It's actually fixed. EA fixed it. That looks good. It clips a little bit, but it was really bad before and it's fixed. They let us actually put it out where we can show it to you guys because they knew they were going to fix it. Yeah, Drake May looks great. Now, if we're going to edit a gear, let's go ahead and look at the head gear. Him with the helmet on. One thing I do like is to look at him and look at these players with the helmet on so you can see them, how they will look in game. I like the in game crossover look of how the player would actually look in game via the gameplay of Madden 25. This is something, bro. Let's go ahead and go to Torso and get that long 
long look of Drake May as well. I do like what they're doing. Let's get that side view. The back of that kind of, yeah, the back of that is kind of, yeah, it's kind of crazy, but I know it'll get fixed soon. We'll just report the bug to EA and they'll just get to it as soon as possible. But I do like the way they did it. Let's pull back and just get the full body view with him with the helmet off and a smaller view. Yeah, here we go. We get a full close up and then go back to the longer view. And it looks just like them, bro. Like, go to head gear real quick one more time. Up close. This is Drake May. I wanted you to get a great close up and personal look of Drake May. And it's just crazy. Like, I wanted to make sure you guys got it. I was on a different build before and I had a limited time with that build to make those videos. So I didn't get to really go in depth and do my, you know, the stuff that I normally do. If you're new to the channel, I go and I break down like every single player in the game that's got a, a brand new scan update. So that's that. But let's go ahead and get to the fourth pick in the NFL draft in Madden NFL 25. The fourth pick in the NFL draft in Madden NFL, as you see on my screen, Marvin Harrison Jr. Let's go ahead and go to Edit Player Suite and check him out. Marvin Harrison Jr., we've seen him before in my previous videos. If you didn't see it, go check it out. I'll break him down as well in that one. But here we go with the number fourth pick from Ohio State, the wide receiver, the son of Marvin Harrison, Marvin Harrison Jr. And if you look at the appearance, let's go ahead and get that close up. Looks good. It's always something about that final bill that Madden drops to give you that realism and to give you that last, that, that good look, the official good look of players in Madden NFL. And here we go with this Rook, man. I like to go over the rookies. This is something crazy. This looks just like him. A very, very dope scan. Very, very dope body type. It looks just like him. I mean, back then, the body types were different. They were kind of stubby a little bit, but now you can see how long they are and how the body types with the head to body ratio high actually fits the actual player in Madden 25 with the new tech, with the Sapien technology. Sapien Technologies was introduced to Madden NFL 24. I never let go of Sapien because I knew Sapien would be something good for structural and movement movement in Madden. Here we go. Let's go to edit player and go to the head. And this is Marvin Harrison Jr. with the helmet on and the mouth guard, mouthpiece or whatever you want to call it in this mouth right here. It looks pretty dope. Looks good. If we go down a torso. We'll get that long look of him as well. Let's get that side view. The hair looks pretty dope to me, man. Hair has came a long way in Madden, but it's clearly important because of the sideline and the technology and where we're going with these generations of consoles. So with that being said, you see Marvin Harrison Jr. And it looks like Marvin Harrison Jr. I'm going to pull back and get the full view of him with the helmet off. This is a very serious scan, and I'm so happy that he decided to sit down and sign his deal with the NFL, where he can actually be added to Madden NFL 25, because he was a huge guy in college, had a huge game, was doing big things, and we need him in the game. He changes the trajectory of football. Marvin Harrison Jr. right here. I'll go back one more time to give you that in helmet look of him up close with a long view, and then we'll go up to headgear and get that close up of Marvin Harrison Jr. So let's get to the next rookie that was added to Madden NFL. 25 via the draft. Let's look at that face scan. Let's get it. And with the fifth pick from the NFL draft was Joe Alt, the right tackle out of Notre Dame. He is in Madden NFL 25. I went and sit down yesterday and I literally went through the NFL's website's draft and tried to get all this, the information together for you guys. But here's his face scan. He is that vital. Number five, the right tackle. He's very vital to have in. And you see he has an actual face scan in the game. Shout out EA for the face scan. Here we go right here with Joe Alt. Looks just like himself. Let's go ahead and pull back and get the full body look. This guy's pretty freaking tall man if you look at his body type long arms long legs his wingspan is pretty long especially for a football game it was a basketball game it'd have been much different uh, as far as wingspan like it really matters but in football too the wingspan matters because you can do certain things like jump high catch picks push off like it's just crazy but if you look at the head to body ratio it does not look bad let's go over to apparel and look at mr alt and his full apparel with pads and everything with the helmet on looks pretty dope it's going to edit gear check him out up close his face looks good doesn't look too big or too small in the helmet Everything's on point to be precise. I do like that. Let's go to torso and just check him out too as well with the helmet off just to see how long he is up close to get a better look at him. This is pretty freaking good. He ate them boy good over there. This is nice. Let's put him in circles and look at him now. You do see how lopsided some pads looking right now, but it's okay. I know they're gonna fix that. I'm waiting for the day one patch because it's gonna have a lot in it and I'm gonna be covering it on the channel. So, and you see him up close with the helmet on with the long view as well. Then we go back up close and this is Joe Alt. So this looks really good. Shout out Madden for this. This is probably one of my better scans right here that I I do like you know and the Caleb Williams that, that one's hard to beat I mean they did a phenomenal job on the Caleb but here's Joe Alt right here let's get to the number six pick in the 2024 NFL Draft. Let's get it. And with the number sixth pick in the NFL Draft, we have Malik Neighbors from LSU, the wide receiver in Madden NFL 25. He has a face scan. Yes, he is in the game. And I will leave a list of players that do have a face scan in the comment section and a description where you can open it and just go look and follow along with the video. If you wanna do that, you can do that with me because I've already scrubbed the game up and down to do so. So check out Malik Neighbors right here. It looks right. It looks just like him. Number nine, is he gonna wear number nine because the kicker has number nine on that team? 
team and i don't know if he's going to get that number up i don't know but this is malik neighbors if you check out the earrings you do see the diamond stud in his ear looks so fire bro that it looks like this check out the actual skin you do see the actual marks and you see the discoloration and the pigmentation in his skin if you go to the side if you look at him up close this looks just like him i think Matt did a phenomenal job on his skin as well this is pretty good stuff the hair too i gotta rate the hair probably like a nine out of a ten it's almost there yeah you almost got it i know when we get next gen consoles the next gen i know it's, like, it's gonna look even realer yeah this is malik neighbors right here let's go ahead and go over to the apparel part of the situation and look at edit gear um let's get let's look at malik neighbors in his helmet with the mouth guard i mean you know this crosses over we've done this before with other players previously and let's go ahead and go to torso and look at him but the long look i do like the way it looks from this angle as well don't look bad this ain't this ain't no problem this is not no problem this ain't no problem whatever you want to call it this is really good y'all let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about malik neighbors in madden uh his rookie face scan this is his debut scan so the great thing i do like about this too as well is that when you get a rookie scan in madden for say they may change something they may get a fresh face scan when ea travels around with the rig to different teams to scan players in the game and they'll get a more up-to-date look so yes and the art team is that good to fix things and alter too as well i remember my nba live days was to travel down they used to just fix what they had before for say if lebron james had a scan at nba live they upgraded and updated that scan from previous years to make it look real so the art team is phenomenal over there at ea sports this is malik neighbors it's him let's get to the next pick with the number seventh pick in the 2024 nfl draft jc latham from crimson alabama the crimson tide guys was drafted to the titans now does he have a face scan is the question jc latham does not have a face scan in madden nfl just yet and if he does have a face scan it will be patched in at a future date uh this is early release we do still have the day one patch dropping in the game soon dropping like this friday we may get him then but i wanted to go ahead and just get this of him and show you guys that it's a placeholder face scan uh a placeholder just look of jc latham and in, in the game so I, I yeah you gotta do that because i didn't want to skip over anybody because i want you guys to actually know the accurate information on how these scans and how this stuff works in madden nfl 25 so let's get to the next player since he didn't have a real face scan just of yet let's get to the next player man with the number eight pick in the nfl draft or the 2024 nfl draft is michael penix jr the quarterback out of washington bro the falcons picked him up madden got him in let's see what the scan is hitting like so far let's go all the way over to the appearance and this is michael penix jr in madden nfl 25 the actual release version and he looks just like himself i do really like how they got the, the actual hair how it's layered on top of the head you can kind of see the waves a little bit from the back how they like 360 how you, you see what i'm saying the 360 wave and how the pattern looks but it looks pretty good he has the princess cut earring as well i can't wait till madden starts to implement jewelry into the game because a lot of these nfl players are wearing chains jewelry drip uh cubans diamond stuff whatever you want to call it these guys are wearing it and madden's doing it with the earrings but the chains would really change things up and the chokers would change things up let's pull back on michael penix jr and as you can see this is the full body look of michael penix jr and man it looks good from afar too one thing about it like i said it has to cross over really good it has to cross over really good into gameplay and that's one of the number one things i look at it for because it can look good in the edit suite or creative players the week all day but it needs to look great in the game when you're playing it with gameplay so here we go right here let's go over to apparel and look at him close up with his equipment on let's go into the edit the gear tab and look up close at Michael Penix Jr. in his helmet. Yeah, it looks pretty good. This is exactly what I like to see because back in previous Maddens, things looked kind of off somewhat where the heads didn't fit correctly in those helmets or those style of helmets. But I think what they had to do was kind of restructure things to put the heads in the helmets to make them fit right and the angles to be right with the head to body ratio which is good and let's look at him with a full body look i'm gonna pull back and check michael penix jr out i do give this probably a 10 out of a 10 as far as him looking in the helmet and outside of the helmet one more of one of the real looking guys in madden nfl 25 when it comes to face scans guys this is good a full body look and let's go to torso and break down that torso and check that out looks good earrings are hitting no clipping on anything bro i am so nitpick when it comes to attention to detail and things look in the correct way when i'm playing my game and shout out ea for getting him right while i play my game if i'm up against him or using him player lock whatever you want to call it but yeah michael penix jr looks great pull back right here you'll see him with his helmet with the long look looks good some side views you feel me go down i mean this is really what you want to see especially with football season so close to the real season because we got preseason already but here we go we got to get to the next player though let's get it with the number nine pick in the nfl 2024 nfl draft we have the wide receiver uh 
uh, out of Washington. His name is Rome Adunzie, and here he is for the Bears, and he does have a face scan in that NFL 25. So if you guys want to know if you wanted to buy Madden or if he had one, if he's your play favorite player, and if you guys wanted to know if Rome was in the game, he is in the game. EA Sports, it's in the game. Rome is right here, as you see, looking just like himself with the gold hoop earring. You see the nose ring, the diamond stud. Looks just like him. Braids, everything is on point. This is one of my higher rated scans. I got to get one. This one like a 9.5 out of a 10. If I was rating it on a drip meter, this would be a 9.5 out of a 10. And Madden, bro, this is crazy. This looks great. I'm going to pull back on Rome and look at him right here. You see that EA got everything right when it comes to his drip. It looks good. looks great. It doesn't look bad at all. So we're going to go ahead and go to the apparel. Check out his apparel. As you can see him with the helmet on, with the mouth guard, mouthpiece or whatever you want to call it. It looks insane. Let's go ahead and go to edit gear and look at the close-up of him in his helmet. Like I say, this is, it's not much I can say about this because this is one of the players that EA did promote uh, with promo, with trailers and stuff like that when the Madden campaign was going for promo. Now that the game is out, you get to see. Let's go to Torso and look at him with the helmet off to get that longer look, to get that close-up look with, with the close to the body. Uh, that pad is kind of annoying hanging up. Here we go right here, guys. This is it. Bam. This is pretty freaking good. This looks great. I don't know what else to say. I really don't have anything to say about him that, is that they hit that right on the money. Let's get to the next player. The number 10 pick in the 2024 NFL Draft is J.J. McCarthy, the quarterback out of Michigan. The Vikings own J.J. McCarthy. He scanned in Madden NFL 25, and it looks just like him. But he has to go a meniscus surgery in real life, which is crazy. So uh, a speedy recovery to my guy right here. He's so young and he's a budding superstar. I know he's gonna be good, but here's his face scan. He looks just like himself. JJ McCarthy is JJ McCarthy in Madden NFL 25. I'm gonna pull back and go ahead and get that view. As you see, he got the J's on, bro. Looking just like himself. Hair looks good too. One thing I gotta rate is the hair. That hair is a 10 out of a 10. I like when the hair and everything matches. Look at the face scan, look at the bumps. On the actual side, you see like the little mole on the, or whatever, like the little bump or hair bump or whatever you want to call it on his face. That is that. This is him. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, JJ McCarthy. Let's go over to the apparel tab though and look at his apparel edit gear and look at him in this helmet to see how realistic he looks inside the helmet. You know, that's going to cross over to gameplay. This is him with the Oakley visor on. Does not look bad at all. Pull back for a full body. Yeah, this, this this is just great. I'm, I'm not mad at it. Look at the accessory. Look at the drip, though. They have, like, the sleeve halfway, like, on the uh, on the arm, on the bottom of the elbow, and then the actual full sleeve on the other arm. I do like that, that attention to detail. Let's go on the torso and see him with a kind of long look. The long look is not bad at all. Looks just like him. I... What do y'all think in the comment section below? Let me know in the comment section below what y'all think of the J.J. McCarthy. He's probably like one of the top guys that I rate and face scans on Madden 25. This five. Let's get to the next one, though. Let's get it. And with the 11th pick in the 2024 NFL Draft, we're going to see in Madden today with a face scan is Olamaya Fashanu. And this guy's from Penn State, the left tackle. And he is in Madden. He does have a face scan. Let's go ahead and jump into it. And boom, this is one of the better face scans. The texture looks amazing. It looks phenomenal on this face scan right here, fam. This is something crazy. Shout out EA, shout out Madden and the art team for this phenomenal face scan right here. It, it don't get no better than this, people. Look at this right here man like, i'm just gonna look at it the bags under his eyes it just says it enough for me it gives me the realistic look of this guy right here man look at the beard the layer of the beard the hair looks good too i like the hair physics it is clipping a little bit but i mean it's a video game it's not real life it's almost real life if you want to know if, if how i feel about the situation but let's pull back and look at the full body as you see long big guy big arms has a long stature big frame body type looks really dope let's go over to apparel and see what he's looking like in that helmet we're going to edit gear get that close up bam here we go right here check him out does not look horrible at all looks one of the best looking scans in the game i do love the skin texture and how shiny and how it pops and it gives that kind of you know real feel when you actually look at him now we're going to go to torso when we go to torso we're going to look and see what he's like in this form yeah, this is pretty dope. Ooh, that pad though. Mm -mm. No, nah, but check it out though. This looks pretty good. If we go out and leave it, it's gonna show us a different version of him with the helmet on in this form at this angle, the long angle, and it looks really dope, bro. Like, yeah, he's one of the higher ones I rate. He's like a 9.5 out of, out of a 10 too. Let me know his rating. What would you rate him in the comment section below? Let's get to the next player though. The number 12 pick in the 2024 NFL Draft is Bo Nix from the Oregon Ducks. He's playing for the Broncos right now and he does have a face scan in Madden NFL. 
25 and look at Bo Nix, one of probably the most realistic looking player likeness updates in Madden NFL 25 when it comes to sharpness. I feel like this face is very sharp. You can see the indentions and the pock marks and everything in his face, his acne, everything shows up as if this was Bo Nix in IRL in real life. This is not bad at all. This is a good looking Bo Nix scan. Check out the mole, or if that's like a birthmark in his head on the side. You see that under the neck. EA did a phenomenal job with this one. This is a 10 out of a 10 to me. I'm gonna pull back and see that angle and how he looks in his pads with the body type. Looks phenomenal, man. This guy looks great. Looks just like him. Self, let me know in the comment section below if this Bo Nix is realistic to you or not. To me, he's realistic. We're gonna go into apparel and look at him as well. Going to edit gear, see him with the helmet on. Bo Nix, a, a bona fide, certified, realistic looking scan in Madden. Probably one of the best I've seen in years. I've seen some good looking scans and some good looking pair of likeness updates in games. And this Bo Nix is just incredible. Shout out to EA for this one. Let's go to Torso and get that close up of him with the helmet off. And I do like this actual angle, the muscle everything the body type really does hit the way it needs to this crazy right here fam i like this the blue eyes too like if you look at the eyes and the iris and just how the eyes hit crazy let's look at him with the helmet on and this angle too as well bo nicks mm, this is bo nicks for real this is fire all right let's get to the next one though we got to keep it moving let's get it with the number 13th pick in the 2024 nfl draft is brock bowers from the georgia bulldogs the tight end that was drafted to the raiders is he in mad let's find out and here we go with a brock bowers sighting it does look like him. I was kind of conflicted and confused a little bit because I was like, okay, is this him or not? This could be a crazy face from EA. And what got me is his actual skull cap, the actual cap that he has on with the Raiders logo. It had me confused, but it does to me look like Brock Bowers from the Bulldogs for the Raiders. Now let me know in the comment section below if you think this is Brock Bowers, if it looks like him. I would like to know what you guys say in the comment section below what about Brock Bowers. Now look at the full body look of him. The numbers kind of go down a little bit uh, as far as the jersey number. So maybe that's something they're working on. And maybe that's just the way he's built and it's just going down. Y'all let me in the comment section below what y'all think. Chime in on this, man. But no, check out Brock Bowers right here. Looks just like himself. Let's go into apparel, though, and see what it looks like with the helmet on. Here's the Brock Bowers with the helmet on right here. Now, it looks more like him now. Maybe the little skull cap he had on to protect his hair is probably threw him off a little bit to the point where it didn't look just like him to me. But it looks like him now with the blue eyes, the face. And he does, he does have a face scan in the game. Uh, y'all gotta correct me in the comment section below if y'all don't think this is him, but I think this is him. Let's go to Torso and get that look too as well. Yeah, this looks this looks pretty dope. Like I said, the only thing that's getting me is the numbers, but maybe the numbers are just shaped that way because of the, the body and the way he's standing and his stature with the pads under it, you feel me? So that is what it is. Let's pull it back and see him in the helmet right here at this view. Looks good. Let's get to the next player. With the number 14th pick out of the 2024 NFL draft for Madden 25 is Talise Fuaga, the Oos, left tackle out of Oregon state he plays for the saints and let's go ahead and get into it and drop into the edit player tab let's just figure out what he's looking like is this him mm, uh talise fuaga yeah that's him that's him he is him let me know in the comment section what you think about this one his neck is kind of thick maybe that's how thick his neck is in real life under the pads you feel me so this is him this looks just like him as you actually get to look at it and keep staring at it i'm gonna go over to appearance and get that close up so we can get that close and personal up and personal look of Fawiz Fluaga and Madden NFL 25. Yeah, this is good stuff, man. Yeah, what's the, oh yeah, look at that. See, if I wanna spun him in circles, Look at the hair. Gotta give his hair a 10, bro. He has like the little tail. This is something that the Samoans people do. Um, Yeah, bro, the oos. That's so fire, bro. Like it reminds me of Solo Sokoa a little bit type stuff. You know what I'm saying? No, this is a good looking scan. Let's pull it back, check it out. That's a big guy. He's a huge dude, man. Let's go ahead and go to the apparel and check it out and see what he looks like in edit gear. That tab, uh, yeah. He has no neck. Maybe this is just how his stature really is in real life though. Seriously, because this looks just like him. Let's go to the torso tab and just see what he's looking like uh, at this angle too up close. It's some good stuff. This is some good stuff. Madden, y'all did a good job on this, man. The number 14th pick out of the 2024 draft. Let's get to the next one though. And with the 15th pick from the 2024 NFL draft for Madden 25 with a face scan, is Latu, Latu, the right end out of UCLA. Let's go ahead and click in and check him out to see if his face scan is there. And as you see, that is him. We have a face scan for him and let's go up and go close and look at it. This is 
pretty nice, brother. This is pretty nice. I mean, they are really nailing this with this new technology over at EA Sports. I think College Football 25 gave them that, that boost that they needed to go and invest in a different game and build on a different frame and foundation to give us better looking players for face scans, technology, gameplay, etc. on the Madden side. So let's go ahead and pull this back real quick and look at the full body. Number 97 right here in Madden NFL, Lion 2, La 2. He's here, this is him. He has some huge arms with the baggy arm sleeves, bro. Pretty drippy, you know? Uh, I give this like an 8.5 out of a 10 as far as the rating for the face scan. I think it looks great. Let's go ahead and look at him in helmet though. In helmet, this guy looks phenomenal in helmet, man. This is crazy, it's crossing over the way I think it should. Check it out right here from the ear. Yes, sir. Let's go to the torso though and check out that torso look. Yep, yep, that does it for me, fam. That does it for me, man. Uh, let's go ahead and go back and look at him at this angle. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I'm with it. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this, man. If y'all follow him, if y'all know him, like if you're a fan of him, let's get to the next pick though. The 16th pick from the 2024 NFL Draft is Byron Murphy the second out of Texas. He plays for the Seattle Seahawks, and does he have a face scan in Madden NFL 25? Well, let's find out. No, he does not have a face scan in the game. This is clearly a placeholder face. Like I said, these face scans may be coming through the first title update in Madden. The title updates do drop in face scans, folks, so, and I'll be covering them, so make sure you stay locked for that. Let's just get to the next phase and not waste time. The 17th pick out of the 2024 NFL Draft is Dallas Turner from Alabama, the right outside linebacker for the Minnesota Vikings, has a face scan. Now, let me tell you this. The last build we had for early content, he was not even in the game. But as of today, when I downloaded the Madden game, he's here. His face scan is here. This is a 10 out of a 10 to me, right? This is a 10 out of a 10. When I was actually going through the face scans to do my checklist, this was what it was right here. This is what you call great face scans. This is what you call a great crossover from real life into a video game by the name of Madden NFL 25. This is it right here. I like the drip, the drip up there, but the drip like a 9.5 out of a 10. That's the drip factor rating right there. Let's go ahead and go to the apparel and see him with the actual helmet on and edit gear tab and check him out fam. Looks just like him guys. Y'all got to let me know what y'all think about this one. This is a 10, 10 right here, boy. 10 out of a 10. Let's go to the torso and check out the torso. I do like this one look at the hair they got the hair twisted just perfect has this texture too of his beard like the actual texture like people call it taco meat people call it hamburger meat whatever you want to call it like tyree says in fast and the furious hamburger meat all on your chest Bruh. you know what i'm saying but that's crazy right there bro it looks just like him let's pull back and see him in the helmet up close at this angle this looks great with the mouthpiece and the mouthpiece mouth guard whatever you want to call it is not clipping sometimes the mouth guards clipped in previous maddens but i don't see them clipping in this version of madden and we're so early in the process of madden so far that it's just crazy that it's just like so good i'm just stoked fam i'm stoked that this is happening right now but uh yeah let's get to the 18th pick and look at that face scan let's get it the 18th pick out of the nfl draft the 2024 nfl draft is amarius mims the right tackle out of georgia for the Bengals. let's click and see if he has a face scan right now let's check that out and see if madden did their due diligence no we do not have a face scan for Amarius Mims, the right tackle out of Georgia. He's not in the game. This is not a real face. This is a placeholder face. Hopefully we get that on the day one patch. Let's go ahead and move to the next player. We don't want to waste no time. Let's get it. With the 19th pick out of the NFL draft, the 2024 NFL draft that is, is Jared Verse, the left outside linebacker from Florida State. He plays for the Rams and he is in Madden NFL 25 from the first round fam. And as you can see, this is a phenomenal looking face scan. One of the better looking face scans. People, look at this. The eyes, bro, you can't tell me like they got the eyes, they nailed the eyes, brother. One thing about people is the eyes. If you get the eyes right, you get the whole situation right. Look at the beard, the texture, how everything goes, the princess cut earrings. Let's get that side view. Look at the fade from the back. Has the fade, has the beard, the sideburns faded into the beard, into the fade. Looks great. Let's pull it back real quick and see what he looks like up front with the whole body shot. Pretty big guy, pretty dripped out. Check out the uh, the tape on his hand. Oh man, on his wrist or whatever you want to call it. Look at the sleeve with the glove. Uh, EA did they do diligence with this joint, bro. Let's go ahead and spin him in circles real quick. I don't spin everybody in circles, but he deserved to be spent in circles. Let's go to apparel and see what he's like in his helmet. Oh, he has a mouth guard. Is it clipping? The mouth guard is not clipping. I am just very, 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 very surprised with that, man. That's dope. Let's go to torso. Look at him with the torso look. Click in it and let's just see what he looks like from this angle. And uh, yeah, in game, he should be a beast dope in game to cross over with the gameplay. Yeah, this is one of EA's better scans. This is like a nine, maybe a nine out of a 10. Drip factor, probably like an 8.5 out of a 10. Let's get to the next player. 
This is good stuff, EA. Y'all keep doing it. With the 20th pick in the 2024 NFL Draft is Troy Hutanu, right tackle out of Washington, and he plays for the Steelers. Does he have a face scan? Let's find out. A lot of the Samoans, the Usas, have face scans in the game, and this does not look like Troy Futanu. This looks like just a face scan that was put in the game. I guess he's just trying to. I guess this this is a placeholder. You know, y'all know you know what we talk. You know what I'm trying to say. This is a placeholder for Troy Futanu. And yeah, this is not him. So let's just jump to the next guy. Let's get it. With the 21st pick out of the 2024 NFL Draft is Chop Robinson from Penn State, and he plays for the Miami Dolphins. Here he is right here in Madden 25. Let's hop into the edit player and see Chop Robinson. And how does he look? Is this a real deal? Holy field scan. This is the the real deal holy field scan of chop robinson and bad nfl 25 check out the diamond stud the diamond stud even has attention to detail look at the quality of the diamond stud in his ear the face the eyebrow like the hair of the eyebrows fam like it's crawling like it's crazy look at this right here he's shaved as you can see got shaving bumps this is crazy the hairstyle the hair is like a 10 bro you know it's like the squint, the sponge thingy, whatever, bro. Like, yeah, it looks real. Yes, yes, this is good stuff. The fade is on point too. You know I'm gonna look at it all, bro. Attention to detail is what we do on this channel. Let's switch it up. Let's pull it back. The full body look. Yeah, have y'all been watching the Hard Knocks with the Dolphins? I've been watching it every night. I am so addicted to the Hard Knocks Dolphin series, bro. This looks just like this guy Chop Robinson from Penn State. Let's go over to apparel and see what happens with the head gear on. Man, mouth guard, mouthpiece, looks fire in helmet. This is Fuego, this is crazy. Let's go to Torso and look at him with the helmet off. Look at this, look at his earrings, they just bling, bro. Oh, bling, bling, he got bling, bling. Oh my goodness, yeah, this is fire, bro. Drip factor nice too. Let's just, let's, just, let's go back, let's just go back. Let's go back and let's, let's look at this. This is, this is phenomenal stuff, bro. Like I am so happy at EA put this in the universe, bro. They switched it all up. Let's go to the next player though. The 22nd pick from the 2024 draft is Quinion Mitchell, the cornerback out of Toledo, plays for the Eagles and he did make it into the game. He's in Madden NFL 25 and does he have a face scan is always the question mark. No, this does not look like him. Y'all let me know if y'all think this is him. I don't think it's him. Uh, let's just go for a close up. I this does not look like him. Maybe it's a placeholder, but or maybe I'm seeing something wrong, but my eyes are not broken and I'm pretty good at this because I'll sit here and study this stuff for hours and hours until we get it right. And uh, no. Anyway, with the number 27th pick out of the 2024 NFL Draft, we have Brian Thomas Jr. from LSU, the wide receiver for the Jaguars. Let's see if this rookie has official, the official face scan and Madden NFL. Oh, this looks real. He kind of looks like uh, Calvin Ridley a little bit. You feel me? Let me know in the comment section if you think Brian Thomas looks like Calvin Ridley. Maybe he was replacing Calvin Ridley, Ridley uh, in, the, in, in the game for the Jags, bro. Check it out, though. This looks exactly like him. The hair is exactly like his hair. This is in a phenomenal face scan. EA, this is a 10 out of a 10. I got to give y'all a hand for this one. This one's crazy, fam. But check it out right here. This is insane. This is nuts. The body, everything fits, bro. They, they, they gotta fix that back pad, dude. That back pad need to be fixed, bro. It's giving me the heebie-jeebies, fam. All right, let's go to edit gear and let's see what it looks like in the helmet. Yeah, looks like up inside of the helmet. Yeah, this crosses over pretty good. Let's see if his hair hangs out the back of it. His dreads, his locks, or whatever you wanna call them, hangs out the back of his helmet. Let's go to torso and see what he's like. Okay, all right, I like the view. And check it out. Look at how his ear and the hair is behind his ear. That's one thing you gotta just like straight up notice and then you go to this ear, it's over the ear. So it's just different situations and different strokes for different folks how it works with how the hair works in EA Sports games with face scans and hairstyles. Let's pull back. Now you see him with the helmet on, hair hanging out of the helmet at this angle. I don't think the hair uh, at the time continues to roll on that it's gonna get better. Uh, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be dope. And I'm excited about it, fam. Like it's gonna be insane, man, how the hair actually hangs out the helmet. A lot of people too are talking about how the hair hangs out of the helmet and some players don't have dreads or locks hanging out the helmet and they're upset about it. I don't know. I've been hearing from David and Joku that they were gonna fix that just because he complained about that all year last year. So I wanted to just throw that out there because his hair is literally hanging out the helmet this year the correct way. So hopefully in future title updates, we'll get that fixed.
let's get to the next player. With the 24th pick out of the NFL, or the 2024 NFL draft, is Tarion Arnold, the cornerback out of Alabama. And he plays with the Lions. And does he have a face scan? Let's find out if he scanned into Madden, right? Let's see. Nope, this is not him. This is somebody else. Let's get to the next player. The 25th pick from the 2024 NFL draft is Jordan Morgan, a left tackle out of Arizona. And he plays for the Packers. And let's just look and see if he has a face scan in Madden. I do not think this is him. It is not him. Let's move to the next player. The 26th pick from the 2024 NFL Draft is Graham Barton, the center out of Duke. He plays for Tampa. Does he have a scan? Let's find out. No, this is a placeholder. We probably will get him in a future title update. Let's get to the next player. The 27th pick from the 2024 NFL Draft was Darius Robinson, the right end out of Missouri. He plays for the Cardinals. Is he in Madden? Let's hit the button. Bow. Let's see what happens. Is the face scan here? This is not Darius Robinson. This is not a real scan. This is a placeholder. Let's see who the next person is and if they have a scan. The 28th pick, Xavier Worthy from Texas. Plays for the Chiefs, wide receiver. He is in Madden NFL, 25, but does he have a scan? Let's find out. Xavier Worthy, that is not him. It is a placeholder. Let's get to the next player. Number 29 from Oklahoma, the 29th pick in the 2024 NFL Draft, Tyler Guyton. Tyler Guyton, Boomer Sooner, the left tackle from Oklahoma. Plays for the Cowboys, is in Madden. Is he scanned? Let's find out. No. This is not Tyler Guyton, he is not Boomer Sooner, this is placeholder. Let's get to the next player. The 30th pick from the first round of the 2024 draft. Yes, Nate Wiggins, the cornerback out of Clemson. The Ravens have him, Madden has him. Let's see if he has a face scan in the game though. Let's find out, let's see. And this is probably one of the most realistic scans I've seen outside of the few that I've went through in the game. This looks exactly like him. Even the scars on this boy's face right here, man. Under, right by his eyes, the scars under his eye, on his cheek. Look at the actual good stubble growing in on his face, man. Has his little, you know what I mean, his little goatee. Everything seems to be here. His hair is just like 100%. They nailed it on the hair. EA 10 out of 10 on this scan. The hair, the face, the eyes, the brows, the everything. EA Sports is in the game, pulled back, drippy. His spat is a little thick though, but still really, really drippy. I do like it. Let's go to apparel and see what he looks like in the helmet. I know his hair didn't hang out. He probably got it like up under the helmet. I gotta go see him in real life to see what he looks like. He does have a mouth guard though. You feel me? Look at the mouth guard, bruh. Ooh, ooh, this is crazy, fam. Look at this. EA, man. Y'all ain't have to do it. This is this. It's how every scan should look in the game. This is probably one of my favorite scans out of the game. Y'all let me know in the comment section below what y'all think about this. Look at this view. Just spin him in circles. He ain't got no special tattoos and nothing like that, huh? All right, he's good to go. His hair moves a little bit. Okay, his hair actually moves. Hair technology. Y'all know how I feel about that. Let's get to the next player. The 31st pick from the first round of the 2024 draft is Ricky Persall, the wide receiver out of Florida. For the 49ers, he's in Madden. Let's click in and see if his face scan made it into Madden though. Ricky Persall, this is a placeholder. They, I think I see what EA was trying to go with this by giving the, the guy an actual like similar face to like the real deal one in real life. So like this is not bad at all, but I mean, this is not the face scan. This is a placeholder. So let's just get to the next face scan and see if we got another pick, the 32nd pick in the NFL draft from 2024. Let's get it. And with the 32nd pick in the 2024 NFL draft is Xavier Leggett, the wide receiver out of South Carolina for the Carolina Panthers. Does he have a face scan? This is it right here. This is the telltale of all to see exactly what is going on in Madden NFL 25. And as you can see, he does have an official face scan, AKA player likeness, whatever you want to call it. And Madden NFL 25, this looks great. The hair is twisted. This is really, really, really good stuff right here, bro. Looks just like him. Gotta get this a 10 out of a 10. Hair looks good. Everything looks great. Everything is portioned too. Like I always think about the portions of how the body looks with the legs, the arms, the body type. The type is good. It's right. The braids are just like five, but they on point. Let's go over to the apparel and look at the apparel and see what the apparel brings to the table. Mouth guard in his mouth. Let's go to the edit gear tab and see what we can find out of this, guys. This is a phenomenal situation right here. This is good to see that Madden has done so. Let's get this angle right here as well. Let's click out of it, fam. Look at this. This is just it. If you like this, let me know in the comment section below. Leave a like on the video, bro, for like me going through the entire first round of the NFL draft in Madden NFL 25. Let me tell you something too, 32 players, 21 players that are actually in the game. So we're missing about 10 players, 11 players that's not have the official face scans in the game. And I will, I repeat, 
be back with the second round of the NFL Draft Face Scan soon. So subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button. Thanks for all the love that you guys have given me. Let's get to 60,000 subscribers as soon as possible. We about to run it up. I got college football stuff too coming. Y'all just gotta be with your boy, man. Peace.